It's the final night of our Holiday Hope Toy Drive, and we want to finish strong. You still have time to help. That's right. Tonight we are collecting toys at two locations, Grayson Stadium in Savannah and the Walmart in Hardyville. And that is where we find News 3's Andrew Davis and Stasi almost joining us now live. Hey, guys. How's it going out there? All Oh, it's incredible out here. We love the people coming out. We just got two giant, giant amounts of toys from people Shopping out here. Baskets full of toys. A couple said they didn't really have anybody to give presents to this Christmas, so they chose Holiday Hope. Came here, filled up the baskets, and just brought them to us. There's one of them right there. Right there. And then Cindy also came by, and she just dropped off more toys for us. We had Santa himself come out earlier to do this. Yeah. Santa's working hard Salvation throughout Army. the entire time. Salvation Army Santa. Everybody out here is doing a lot. Of course, we're doing it for Bluffton Self-Help. Elaine over here from Bluffton Self-Help. Elaine, talk to us a little bit about what this need is for folks still out there. It's still a great need. We have a lot of um, toys that we have in now, but what we really need are toys for age 18. To 12 boys and girls. Um, our shop opens on Saturday and we just want to make sure we're fully stocked. We've sent out our toys to our partners, so we're excited that they've gone over to Jasper and Hampton County. We just need to finish off our shop. And the numbers are, are staggering on how many people there are. Well, I told Stasi a couple of weeks ago that we were going to go surpass 300. We're at 400 families, almost 2,000 children, and uh, it's all thanks to the great community here in Bluffton. Okay, and of course we are at the Hardyville Walmart out here, which is the key. They've been nice enough to help us. Stassi, you've got some of the people here from Walmart who are right. trying to do their part. That's the cool thing about being at Walmart is that people that come can go shopping and get some <laughs> right. toys, right? So Annie is with Walmart. Give us a quick sound bite about what, what, why you do this. Well, as the new store manager at Hardyville Walmart, we're happy to partner with the community and Bluffton Self-Help to be able to help the kids in need at this time of year. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. We are going to be here until 630. We'd love to see you. Come on by. If you don't have a toy at home, you can get one here at Walmart in Hardyville. Thanks for watching, guys. Back to you.